Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to part 13 of Let's Play Magic Knight. I am in Palazu Village, and right here, as I just clicked, is where the mysterious rainbow amulet that I was looking for was. And to show you that... See? There we go. And... Our next point of travel. We head north, because if you go south, you go back to Precious Manor. Which, we don't want to go there yet. We want to go to Taflon by the Sea. Strange name for town. Because the by the sea name, that's part of the name. It's Taflon by the Sea. Anyway. As you would imagine, being by the sea, this is going to be a port town. <coughs> See? Port. Oh, crap. We can't go into the water. So, yeah. We still can't go into the water. So it's a fishing town that's not catching any fish. Yoink. Alright. So there's a couple of people we gotta talk to here. As they talk about whirlpools and whatnot. So we're basically just going to go around and, you know, do the, the role-playing thing of uh, breaking into people's houses and talking to them about various crap. We're looking for a couple of people in particular. And as you can see, most of the same staples are there. We've got an item shop, we've got the, the fortune teller down there, and the uh, recovery well there. And right here, we have a green rainbow amulet. And Billy here tells us about them. He's a little late to the party. Yes, the princess is in trouble. Your princess is in another castle. That's the problem. This house is a little girl that everyone was talking about with a creepy little monster pet. Her little Jiminy. His name is Jiminy, yes. And Hikaru throughout this game has some sort of affinity with creatures. Uh, it's actually my understanding that she's the only one who can really communicate with Makona. Just a little strange. Yes, drink random well water. That's safe. Yes, run. Okay, gotta talk to this old guy. Because he tells us about an island shaped of ice. And a giant dragon. We gotta make our way to the island. Well, that's a problem, because we don't swim or have a boat. Alright, I... Need to learn more about that person they just talked about. Calthus. That's what I need to do. Do you tell me anything? No, you don't tell me anything new. Do you tell me anything new? No. Shut up. You're not... Uh, do I have to talk to you? Yes. Alright, 
And I think I... I'm fairly sure at some point I gotta go back and talk to the Elder again. Alright, so that's Kalthus' empty house. What do you say, kid? And look! Ascot. Yes, let's travel together with the person who's trying to kill us. Alright, let's go back down and talk to the village elder and see if he actually tells me something different. Because, I mean, I know where Kalthus is. We've met him already. Dun dun dun. Snow. There we go. Aha, he did tell me what we needed to know now. We head back. <coughs> I like the overworld music. Sadly, you don't hear it all that often. Back to Paula Zoo Village. No, I oh, did not want to do that. I hate that. I forgot I was coming in through the north end and screw that one up. Because now I'm headed back to Taflin by the Sea. Wouldn't be so bad if the loading times for this game weren't ridiculously atrocious. There we go. Now we go back to Palazu Village. And when I get back to Palazu Village, I'll go ahead and uh, cut the video there. It's a little short, but eh, with the loading times, it does take a little bit. So. Okay. Alright, so we are now back to Palazu Village. So I will go ahead and cut the video here, and in our next installment we will find Caldus and continue on with the story. Till then, later everyone.